morning, brothers and sisters in Christ. Today's devotion is taken from The Desire of Ages by Ellen G. White, chapter 58, page 524. Our Savior appreciated a quiet home and interested listeners. He longed for human tenderness, courtesy, and affection. Those who received the heavenly instruction he was always ready to impart were greatly blessed. As the multitudes followed Christ through the open fields, he unfolded to them the beauties of the natural world. He sought to open the eyes of their understanding, that they might see how the hand of God upholds the world. In order to call out an appreciation of God's goodness and benevolence, he called the attention of his hearers to the gently falling dew, to the soft showers of rain and the bright sunshine, given alike to good and evil. He desired man to realize more fully the regard that God bestows on the human instrumentalities he has created. But the multitudes were slow of hearing, and in the home of Bethany, Christ found rest from the weary conflict of public life. Here, he opened to an appreciative audience the volume of providence. In these private interviews, he unfolded to his hearers that which he did not attempt to tell to the mixed multitude. He needed not to speak to his friends in parables. Do you long to be with Christ as much as he longs to be with you? Do you realize his tender regard for you? Let's pray. Heavenly Father, I know that today Jesus desires to spend time with me and to commune with me. But many times I do not long to be with him because I allow other things to take my time and affection. Please forgive me and please help me to desire to spend time with Jesus. And as I spend time with him, help me to fully realize how much he loves me. May I also know his will for my life. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. May you have a good day ahead of you. Goodbye.